I wanted to be sure to come out and thank you all in person. I wanted to be sure and thank you and say goodnight. It's a very special wrestling town, a very special wrestling tradition. There's a few people here that I'd like to thank. Uh, hey, Taz and Chris Jericho, could you guys come down to the ring, please? It's Philadelphia, guys. Thank you, I love you. When I was a kid, and I could have one thing in the world, it was to come to this city and watch wrestling. And some of my heroes are here tonight, and they work here at AEW, and I just wanted them to have a chance to say goodnight to you because they're really special to the city of Philadelphia, too. So ladies and gentlemen, Taz! Ladies and gentlemen, Chris Jericho! I have a few other friends I'd like to introduce you to. The former ECW television champion, the Iceman, Dean Malenko. You have Dean? I think Dean's here, I believe. Chris knows Dean very well. There we go. Hey, one more friend I'd like to bring out and I'd like each of them to say a very special good night and I just thank you and ladies and gentlemen, the former ECW world champion, Jerry Lynn! Jerry, Jerry, Jerry. Hey, so listen, uh, it's been a long time since I had the opportunity to talk to you guys, a lot of years, South Philadelphia and all that. And, you know, I've had the opportunity to compete, especially these three amazing athletes, amazing men, amazing wrestlers. Uh, Malenko broke my neck in Fort Lauderdale. Jericho's a crowbar, he's stiff. And Jerry Lynn, well, you just would blow guys up in the ring because your cardio is better than everybody. So that always sucked wrestling you. But no, these guys are great, and you all are great. And you know, uh, for me, as an ECW original and all that stuff, and it was an amazing time, and I know a lot of you guys are old enough to remember that and be part of that. But this is, this is, like what we got here is like, it's fucking crazy because it's, it's like a new generation of ECW like on steroids and growth hormone. So, I, I, listen, I've said it publicly and I'll say it again, I don't give a shit if anybody gets hot about it. And I, I don't give a fuck, you can call me a homer, I don't give a shit. This is the best fucking place I've ever worked. I had no idea he was in the ring, I was like, why are they chanting CM Punk? I have the mic now. I didn't even see he was out here. I just want to say I feel extremely left out because I was the ECW champion. And, and, nobody, and nobody invited me. And I just want to make a point that I think that's a very important distinction to make because I never would have been ECW champion if it wasn't for a guy like Taz, if it wasn't for a guy like Chris Jericho, certainly if it wasn't for Dean Malenko or Jerry Lynn. So, just, I thought it'd be funny if I stuck my head out here really quick, because I was ECW champion. And now I'll leave it up to them. Isn't it great to have CM Punk back, right? 
Guys, we know it's been a long night, and, and we appreciate you guys. We always love coming to Philadelphia. Uh, my first time in Philadelphia was with ECW in 1996, after I called Paul Heyman for one year to try and get booked. He never answered, and then he called me one day and said, I've been trying to get a hold of you for one year. We had a great time at the arena. We used to stay at the Ramada Inn down the road. I'm sure some of you were there. If you weren't, it's good that you weren't. If you were, you know why it was good that they weren't. But once again, we thank you guys for being here. This is the new tradition in wrestling. This is the greatest wrestling company in the world today. This is really the new revolution, and this is happening now live with all of you. We're not stopping, we're only just beginning, and in 20 fucking years, you'll still be chatting AW, and I'll still be here to talk to you, and so will he, and so will he, and so will they. A man of few words and many holds. A man of few words and many holds, but he's got something to say. I'll just keep it short. Thank you very much. That's it. I just wanted to say thank you because everywhere I have wrestled on this planet, you guys here in Philly have been the most passionate and you reinforced it when I went to a Phillies game and I was like, oh my God. But you guys have never let us down here in Philly and you are the craziest MFers I've ever seen. Thank you so much, Philadelphia. It's been a great night. I can't thank you enough for being here. I can't wait to see you again. Happy anniversary! Hit the music! Oh,